Guys, we have another case for the Galaxy Z Fold 6. This is called Shock Proof Cell Phone Case. Okay, I kind of love the fact it says shock proof like that. But it says that this is craft, anti-scratch, eco-friendly, comfortable touch, um, and all that other kind of stuff. Now, this does have a area that protects the hinge. Which is um, something that, of course, like, for example, Samsung's case, this one right here, does not protect the hinge. Which is disappointing. But this one does. So, whoo lordy, look at this bad boy right here. <laughs> okay. So, how do I even get this started? So, this is the hinge protection, by the way. Um... I was gonna. I feel like there's probably an easy way to do this, but what is this? This is accessory kit. Okay. So I think I guess I just ripped that. What is this? This is like little wipes things to clean the display, because it does have a outside screen protector, which I'm kind of about to be honest. I don't really like it when they have outside screen protectors on these cases. Um, but it is what it is at the end of the day. So, let's see. I guess I'll just go through this the correct way. So, you have dust absorber, glue. Okay, so alcohol pad, alcohol pad. That's pretty much what it is. So, how are you supposed to do these? Is you're supposed to just rip this. Take this out, unfold it. Okay, if I can unfold it, just like that. And then, okay, whatever. It does not want to work with me, but cool. And then you just kind of do this. Usually there's a dry one. Usually there's a wet one and there's a dry one. The whole point of this is just to get you know, any dust or any problems off of it before you apply the screen protector, which should be just like that. Okay. Now, I don't believe this is actually a screen protector, screen protector. This is just like an outside cover. So it's not like a, bro, I just touched the screen. Oh, okay. Where did I throw that pad? Or that wipe? Okay, I'm going to use another wipe then. Because I literally did just touch the screen. <laughs> I don't know where I threw that wipe at. Alright, so one more wipe down and then we'll put it on. So it's just pretty much plain and simple like this. Let it dry a little bit. This is why, again, they usually give you, like, a, a dry one. Two wets and a dry. But for some reason, they don't here. Oh, that's where I was. Okay. Oh, that would be a problem. Hang on. I'm going to let this... One sec. Let me get a cloth for this. All right. This is why they usually give you a dry one. <laughs> after giving you a wet one. Because usually it benefits that way. All right. Let's do that. That is on. And then we have our lens protector on the back. Holy crap. This makes this phone so thick. Okay, let me just try to, hold up. Okay, I'm gonna have to do this again, one sec. Ugh. Okay, there's a little smudgy smush. Okay, one second guys.
why I hate these screen protectors. Because, like, little pieces of dust is, like, always get underneath this screen protector. Or, I mean, these screen covers. It's not really a screen protector. But, these screen covers. So, I mean, yeah. This is a thing. This thing is so thick. So it does protect the... It does protect the hinge. But you can't use the outside display while this is on. You can put the S Pen in here. Like that. So it lets you hold the S Pen. Look how thick that is, boys. I mean, okay. You protect your lenses. Can I unlock the phone? There we go. Um, button layout wise, not the greatest. You can see it blocks off some of the buttons, so it's harder to press the thing. But I will say for the most part, it's not horrendously bad. And then you have your S Pen right here. That kind of just slides right out. I guess sliding right out is not a good term on that one. You have to really kind of like shimmy it out. But okay. And then you also have this bad boy back here. Which <coughs> is easier said than done. Oh, does it move? No. Okay, there we go. You have to unsnap it. And this is where you put in cards. Okay, but why is this so difficult to open? Am I crazy? Even with a fingernail. So I, I thought it was like something like you had to like push it forward or something. But it's not. Okay. Hold up, is this even on correctly? Because these are the buttons for this, right? Wait, what is going on here? Why is there buttons right here that says plus and minus? This looks like it would be right for here. Bro, what is this case? <laughs> this is impossible to open up. You have to really get this one to open it up. That is, <clears throat> it's possible. See, like, this makes me think that these would go over here, but they wouldn't. Because this is a plus and this is a minus. That's, I mean, listen, if you want to go with the crazy, crazy Amazon cases, I will give you this is your crazy option. Tell me down below your thoughts and opinions. <laughs> oh, man. Can you imagine being in a store? Hang on, guys. I gotta... I'm gonna get my credit card out. Come on, bro! Come on! Um... There's gotta be an easy way to do this. See, like, I thought it was, like, maybe it's, like, a slide thing. You know, like, you slide forward and then you pull, but it's not. It's literally a brute force. There's no way this is brute force. And that's not even lined up correctly, by the way. That's not lined up. So, it's, like... Uh, this case makes no sense. It's, like, they had a good idea with this case. They really did. The idea is not bad, okay? Protects the lens, good. Protects the hinge, awesome. Has an S Pen cover, I mean, a, a S Pen holder, perfect. Has an outside display that doesn't seem really that, you know, crazy responsive. Not sure what this crap is. Has, like, it's a good premise, but I think they missed the mark. 
And the sad part is, I don't know what the mark is. Like, what actually is the mark here? Tell me down below your thoughts and opinions. I feel like if I drop this, I might just break the case. I don't know if I break the phone. Bro, my fingernail is coming off my body trying to get this open. Hold up. Okay, I'm going to... Is there any instructions? There's no actual instructions. We don't we don't get instructions with this. <laughs> I don't think you you're not supposed to have break your fingernail trying to get this to work. I don't think that's the idea. Alright. Tell me down below your thoughts and opinions. I'll see you guys next one. Peace out.